Good morning, FHS. This is not a test. This is Hot Dog Network. It's January 23rd, and it's time to rock it from Old Stony to Case Arena. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, for liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Frankfurt. Buenos dias. For lunch today, lines one and two will have chicken bowl, line three, pork barbecue nachos, line four will have baked mozzarella sticks, and line five will be closed. Today's birthdays, Isaiah Medina, Erica Perez, Braden Perkins, and Zeke Van Deventer. Side note, if you want to see Zeke get pinned in 30 seconds by me, come to our second period APC class, because it's going to happen. Now to weather with Mo Perry. Today, it'll be cloudy with a few showers and a high of 35, partnered by a low of 22. If you drive in any way that would put you in the grass, don't. The mud is not your friend today. Even four-wheel drive cannot overcome the spongy terror. Now back to the studio. Here's this week's Apple Award. Never stick out on the stove like that. Hey, Mrs. Hale. Mrs. Hale. I, I chose you for the Apple Award because, you know, you're, you're a pretty cool teacher. Pretty rad teacher, you know? Pretty rad teacher. Pretty rad teacher. Oh, Ivy, thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> I appreciate it. No problem, miss. Congratulations, Mrs. Hale. Andy's scholarship is now available for grades 7 through 11. The deadline to sign up is March 2nd. The FEF General Scholarship now open. The deadline is to sign up February 17th. For more information, go to frankforteducationfoundation.org. All NHS members will meet in Mrs. Fortner's room Thursday during community. There's no need to check in with community teachers first. Just come directly to the room 137 so that we can get started right away. All Battle of the Books team members for um, Mrs. Guest's team, please meet on Wednesday during community in the library. Paying for college is a lo lot less scary when you understand the different ways to do it. In Financial Aid 101, we'll talk about scholarships, FAFSA or FAFSA, and the infamous student loans. The Connection coach, Mrs. Heights, will lead this presentation on Friday, February 2nd, from 7.30 to 8.15 in Collaboration Space 1. All grades are welcome, and breakfast will be provided. Sign up in Ms. McGuire's office. Best Buddies members mandatory meeting on Wednesday during community. Best Buddies members who wants to go on the field trip Friday must pick up a permission slip and turn that plus the money in by Thursday. Lunchtime Book Club meets this Wednesday, January 24th in all lunches. Bring your book and come during your scheduled lunch. Lunch will be provided. Photo Club also meets during community this, or tomorrow, sorry, for their club group photo for the yearbook. If you have a personal camera, please bring it. As Academic Bowl will be arriving soon, see Senior Fortner for more details if you wish to participate. Students are welcome to sign up for the Visiting Artists Workshop at the Frankfurt Library. In this session, you will learn Bollywood dancing by a professional dancer. The session will be held on February 8th from 4.30 to 6 o'clock. Come check it out. Now here's an interview with Mrs. Long. Hello, Ms. Long. Um, we're here to talk about laptops and the students. And my first question is, students without laptops, how can they get one? We have some students that still don't have laptops, and what they need to do is to fill out the form from the acceptable use policy. Um, those were passed out in the community last week, um, but if a student didn't have one, they could come to the office and get a new one. Um, we gave them a web address where parents could watch a filmed version of a meeting. Parents would then sign off, send it back with their student. The students are meeting in groups with me, and then they get their laptop. In fact, there are 20 students that are meeting with me today and will be receiving their laptops today, which will put a, a fairly large dent in the number of students who don't have laptops. Good, progress. Um, troubles with the laptops, what are like the main most 
troubles that people have with the laptops? We've been really lucky so far in that we've had very few um, problems with the laptops altogether. Um, initially, there was an issue with the sound. Students were, um, the, the audio was turned off on the computer, and Mr. Hale and the people in room 110 um, would go and open it up, fix it for them, and send it right back. Students can always go to room 110 if they have any sort of technological issue, and uh, they can usually work on that and get them back to class immediately. All right, that sounds very educational. All right, well, it was a great seeing you. Thank you. Have a great day. You too. We're good. Have you taken a Project Lead the Way class or maybe Advanced Manufacturing? Are you going into your senior or junior year? If so, you may be eligible for a paid internship opportunity this summer. This is a six-week summer internship that pays over $2,000 and gives you the chance to, to see just what manufacturing today is all about. Last day to apply is January 29th. If you even think you might be interested, contact Mr. Blunt or Mr. Smith or see the link in the description box. The Zonta Club is offering a $500 scholarship to one qualified senior girl enrolled in the Clinton County School Corporation. The goal of Zanta is to encourage young women to participate in public affairs by recognizing a commitment to the volunteer sector. There will be a fan bus for the boys basketball Husker Classic game in Nicetown on January 27, 2018. Game time at 8 p.m. The fan bus will leave at 6 p.m. Tickets cost $10 and it is free to ride the fan bus. Please sign up at the bookstore if you are interested to attending. You must turn in a permission slip and your $10 to the bookstore. Tickets will be given to you when you board the bus on January 27th. The deadline to sign up, pay your ticket, and turn in your permission slip is Thursday, January 25th at noon. This is only open to FHS students. Auditions for this year's spring musical, Bye Bye Birdie, will be held Wednesday, January 24th with callbacks Thursday the 25th after school. Please prepare 16 bars of a song of your choice. If you don't know a song, that's okay, come on out anyway. Any questions, please see Mr. Taylor. 21st Century Scholar is pairing with Ivy Tech Anderson to host an opportunity for families and students to come to receive assistance with their 21st Century Scholarship. They will have FAFSA specialists, state financial aid representatives, and college experts available to answer any questions you may have. The great opportunity will take place on January 25th. This past Friday, Noemi Gihosa placed fifth in the girls' state wrestling meet. Is it on me? <sighs> Noemi is the first Frankfurt girl wrestler to place at the IS, IHS GW state meet. We are extremely proud of Noemi's success and hope it leads to more hot dog female wrestlers. This past Saturday, the hot dog wrestlers placed six at one of the strongest Hobart tournaments in years. Nine wrestlers placed this weekend. Placing top four for the hot dogs were Armando Roa placing fourth, Aldolfo Vasquez Sanchez placing third, Devin Anderson placing fourth, Zeke Vandevener placing fourth, and, Jen and Jordan Ortiz placing second. The boys golf team will have a call out meeting on Friday, January 26 at 8 a.m. for those wishing to participate this spring. The meeting will be in Mr. Rick's room, room 103. Returning players and first-timers should plan to attend. There will be a meeting for all individuals who desire to play football next season. Meet in room 301 on Wednesday during community. That's it for sports. Now back to the studio. Thanks for watching the daily announcements. We're sorry about the technical issues. We're kind of on a time crunch right now. We'll see you tomorrow.